Welcome back, everybody, here at 821 on your Sunday morning. All right, next weekend, there is a conference right in downtown Detroit at the Cambria Hotel that's going to bring together industry leaders from tech, real estate, hospitality, fashion, film, marketing, all under one roof. Yeah, the list is endless. And to share, they'll be sharing some valuable business strategies during this conference. So to talk about how CreatorCon will be a wealth of knowledge, we have Jessica Care Moore and Robert Courtney. Thank you both for being with us. Thank you so Good much. Good to for see you. Yeah. Now, this is your third year. Third year. So, who really benefits from this? Who are we targeting to come out? We're targeting anyone who wants to excel and advance their business. This is the ultimate resource to help grow your business, but then also to be able to network with people from all different industries. And we know how okay. valuable who you know and networking is. Yes. Absolutely. I got a question for you, though. Okay. Why would someone give up those trade secrets? Uh, because I think we at our heart want to inspire the next generations. Mm -hmm. We want other people to learn and grow and benefit from the things that we've learned. And the energy at CreatorCon is a very vibrant, um, sharing type of energy. And so I think that's the biggest aspect that we hear feedback from when people come is just how inviting, how supportive everybody was, was that attended the conference. And Jessica, you yes. have always been this way about mentoring and helping yes. others um, with, with your vast yeah. creative <laughs> uh, abilities. Um, how, are there any success stories? Like it's been three years now. Yeah. Can you think of like how this has really impacted careers? That's really more Roberts. <laughs> but it's not. My, so I'm coming as an artist. Yeah. Uh, as you know, I'm a poet and writer, and so and also it's important for creatives to connect with other creatives who don't do yeah. what they do, right? Yeah. Um, I just learned that I could produce a film, and so I need to know who cinematographers are in the city. I need huh. to know where other screenwriters are. So you're always trying to grow as an artist, and mm -hmm. also I want. I'm a collaborator. Yeah. I love meeting people that can't do what I. Um, what I could do, but the, this is his baby. <laughs> but, yeah. Yeah. On that note, how important is it to connect with those resources mm -hmm. that are here? Yes. That's right. The talent that is here. Oh, right. so much. Yes, that's the, I mean, for us, that's one of the most important aspects of CreatorCon. You can go to all other major cities and you can get conferences like this, yeah. but to do it in Detroit and to mm. give these creatives and these business owners the opportunity to be on stage, mm. I feel like was very, very important. And who is going to be on stage? There, there's some notable people that are yeah, part of this. Yeah, there's a lot. There's local people like Dennis Archer Jr. and obviously Jessica be on stage, but then we're bringing in national talent like uh, Dame Dash and uh, Joshua Alexander and Nicole Hoops Alexander. Wow. So the goal is to create this melting pot of yeah. people who've really done it on a high level, but then also local celebrities and people who are trying to expand. And yeah. I, we have to point out like the talent that comes yes. out of Detroit because you see us yes. on a national level all mm -hmm. over. All over. Right. Um, but this is kind of giving that that leg up to Absolutely. folks that are just kind of starting those careers and and to help dream bigger and show them the roadmap. Yeah, yeah I mean we've been we've been approached so many times about people who want us to bring it to other places. Mm -hmm. Like no, this no. is a Detroit. Detroit thing. Yeah. You want to come, say, you come here. I you say, what up, dope? Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. I say it everywhere. I say it everywhere. Yeah. Say it yes. everywhere. As a, as they a native, know. Yeah. What's it like for you to see, as Rhonda was talking about, some of those success stories or to, or to see people take what, what you learned on your yeah. journey and then implement yeah. it as they're starting their own? I mean, you know, it's important that we're intergenerational, right? And so I know that I have something to give because I have traveled literally all over the world and performed my work on stages in lots of different countries mm -hmm. and bringing that wealth of information to someone. Um, I just went to a, a Pistons event and there was a young lady there that was just getting started. I did I did more at that in that suite with her than wow. I did with any other looking at a basketball game. Yeah. Because she had so many questions uh -huh. and how do you because even, you know, we say local, but we're also, I'm just Detroit based. Yeah. Like I could live anywhere. Yeah. I choose to live yeah. in Detroit. Yeah. Um, and because there's something in the water here, there's something very special here, and there's artists that are not on that, they need that light. Yeah. They need to feel like they can actually be connected to the rest of the planet. Absolutely. And we are. When we go to New York and LA and these other places, you say Detroit. Oh yeah. Oh, they know. They know. <laughs> yeah. So uh, we do want to get the information. It's right there on your screen. Yes. It's next weekend, the 15th and the 16th. You missed the early bird rate, <laughs> but $75 for two days with this, these invaluable yes. resources is yeah. incredible. So you go to CreatorCon, dot com creatorcon detroit dot com creatorcon detroit dot com can people register on site or are you encouraging yes, them no, to pre-register yes no they can register on, on site they definitely should pre-register so they don't miss it okay we cool. love it thank you both for yeah. being in yeah, thank you, thank you so much for having good us good luck hope you get a huge turnout yeah we will for yeah. sure <laughs>